2.1. Outline Michael Faraday's discovery of the generation of electric current by moving magnets. So in 1831, Michael Faraday performed many experiments to discover the relationship between electricity and magnetism and how they are interconnected. He conducted two significant experiments. So experiment one, firstly. Faraday performed an experiment involving moving magnets in and out of coils. He found that the current was induced in the coil. The magnitude or the size of the current depended on how fast he moved the magnet. The direction of current depended on whether he moved the magnet, magnet in or out of the coil. Direction also depends on which pole, so north or south, moved in or out. Experiment 2. Michael Faraday also experimented with two coils at this stage, where one metal ring, he found that nothing happened when a steadily DC flowed through it in ring 1. But when he switched the current on and off quickly, current, the current was induced in a ring or second ring too. So Michael Faraday's conclusions of this is if there is a relative movement between a conductor magnetic field, a potential difference is generated. Two, relative movement can be actual movement of the conductor or changing magnetic field. Three, the magnitude of the potential difference is proportional to the rate at which the magnetic field is cut. So there are the three conclusions Michael Faraday posed after those two experiments there. And the underlying parts in this slide is key to highlight in your books.